you can't let your dog off in public places anyway, which quite frankly, I never really recommend people do anyway, which is why I'm not kind of die hard on remote collars. A lot of remote collar advocates would be like, yeah, because it stops dogs chasing sheep in fields. I'm friends with farmers. Don't let your dog off lead in fields where there's livestock. Just don't do it. You don't need to. Walk them nicely on a lead. They're still getting beautiful exercise and out in the countryside. Don't take risks. Don't set your dog up to fail. Don't ruin other people's experiences and don't harm livestock and people's... Um, ability to make money and provide for their families so that's why kind of like again if e-collars were banned in the uk which many people are trying to do so I, that's a shame because i use that tool to save certain dogs lives in certain cases but cool let's crack on we just have to accept that understand what the reality of that is and now here are the other hundred things that we have in our toolbox that are still left to work with